Supposing I do this figure with the left hand. This can be broken into its three component parts. The vertical, which is playing with gravity, keeping our hand at a certain level, and the horizontal along the length of the string, and finally, the lateral swing of the whole arm. Actually, even when working on these elements separately, we must never completely forget the presence of the other two. But we concentrate on each one separately, remembering that there is not a single motion that does not involve the whole limb from the fingertip to the shoulder blade, in fact. I will do the same figure slowly, trying to exaggerate each motion so that you may see them if, if you can. The very same principles apply to the right hand. If I play this simple stroke, this involves again the maintaining of the arm at a certain level, that is the playing with gravity, with the vertical element. It involves the stroke. And what is perhaps less obvious, it involves the lateral motion of the whole arm, which becomes quite clear in a stroke like this. These elements would not be complete even when put together as we do into the circular and elliptical form, without the third element, which is the supporting motion, the cooperating and coordinating motion of the whole body. This involves posture and elasticity.